Hey guys, welcome to another video by the Outback Cuba. Today, I'm going to be unboxing something from speedcube.com. Let's get into it. First, I'd like to give a shout out to speedcube.com for sending me this parcel relatively fast. I ordered it about two days ago and it got here in two days. Two days, and that's, that's pretty quick. Um, they send express post for all their packages at a flat rate for seven dollars for any package under a hundred and f free for any package over a hundred alright so let's get into it today in this package I have three cubes and I guess you're just gonna have to wait to find out what they are here we go I've got my trusted box opener and I'm gonna cut into it here we go All right, I need to cut down the sides as well, obviously. And across the front. Nearly got myself there. Okay. And then I need to just pull it up. Lift it up. I swear they used to be so much easier to open. Okay, that should do. I uh, butchered the box. And, uh... It's open, so let me just remove the receipt. Yep, all seems to be in order. And open her up. There it is. They're the three cubes that I have. So let's have a look at which ones I got. I got the Shangxiao Killer Minx. It's a new puzzle, and I'm looking forward to learning how to solve it. The a blue ghost cube with um, silver stickers which are in here which by the looks of it needs to be stickered and I got the Diane Zanchi which I'm going to be reviewing later on so probably next weekend or in the near future and the last thing in this box is it will come out the speedcube.com business card which wasn't in my last order so it's pretty cool I like it looks nice all right so now that that box is all nice and empty let's get into opening up these cubes so I'm going to start with the first one I pulled out and I'm going to start with the Killer Minx. Um, the Killer Minx is a pretty new puzzle. Um, it's a pretty new puzzle and I'm really looking forward to opening it up. So this is basically in effect what it is. It's a Mega Minx except without as many layers. All the instructions are in Chinese so I have no chance of knowing what they are. And yeah, skill level six stars apparently. All right, let's uh, open her up. So starting from the bottom. Ooh, the white apparently. Yeah. Empty box. And there it is. So like I said, it is pretty much a Mega Minx. Which, if you don't know what a Mega Minx is, this is mine. But just smaller and without as many layers. So this one only has five, whereas the Mega Minx has um, about double that with a center, and this doesn't have a center. Put that away, zoom out a little bit, other way. And let's have a look at some first turns. So straight off the bat, it's a bit clunky. So, oops. So it's a bit, a bit clunky to turn, and it gets caught a little bit when you're turning. But I'm looking forward to learning how to solve this and trying to figure out how to solve it myself, because it looks like quite a fun puzzle. Um, the color scheme is nice, but I'm not really a fan of this yellow. This, this yellow and probably the grey just because they look a little bit similar and when you're trying to solve it fast 
that can quite quite clearly muck you up. Um, also, um, these are stickers, um, which I don't know. I don't mind stickers, but uh, they do peel sometimes, which can get annoying. Um, and some of the stickers aren't placed quite correctly. So, focus. Thank you. As you can see here, that right there is not quite placed properly. But that's alright. I just need to go back and replace them. Alright, on to the next cube. I think I'm going to open up the, the Zanchi now. So this is a Dian Zanchi. Um, as you all probably know. As I said earlier, of course, is how you know. Um, just, this is the box. Um, yeah. So let's open it up. Made in China. <sighs> Opening it up. Alright, here it is. So I got the stickered. Um, the stickered cube. Stickered black. Because I like black cubes. Um, but yeah. it's It feels really like slimy and greasy off the start. And just like, you know. Yeah, just that feeling out of the start. Um, but it feels like a nice cube straight off the bat. Like, it spins quite fast, but definitely needs some lube. It's quite dry. Um, if I can pull out a piece, that'd be wonderful. That's what the insides looks like. So. It's a bit out of focus. I'm sorry. But yeah, that's what it looks like. I'll put that back in. Yeah. In it goes. But yeah, I will be doing a full review on this cube a bit later. Um, but it is, it is a nice feeling cube. And it's much lighter than I first expected. So yeah. So there is the Diane Zanchi. Next up is my stickers. No, I'm kidding, but these are the stickers for the ghost cube, which I'll probably have to go back and sticker after the video. Great. <laughs> anyway, so I will also be doing a review on this cube as well, because I've always been interested in the ghost cube. So anyway, this is a box, a nice, um, yeah, just a nice box, a nice old fashioned box, just plain cardboard. And let's open her up. I've never had a ghost cube before, so I'd, I'm interested to see how it turns and like how it actually works, if you know what I mean. All right, here it is in a plastic bag. Woohoo! All right, so there is a ghost cube. Man, that looks cool. I really like the blue. Except it's a bit slimy, so I'm just gonna, I have my stand, tissues on standby this time. I'm just gonna wipe her down with a tissue, just to get her, you know, a bit less greasy for the start of this video. Anyway, so here is the ghost cube, and once I put some silver stickers on it, I reckon it'll look pretty nice, in my opinion at least. But yeah, so this is how it turns, you just turn it, the these corners turn on the lines, which obviously, which I find pretty cool. Um, and when you align all the lines like this, it turns again and again. So it's a shape shifting cube, basically. Oh no, don't tell me. Oh, never mind. Anyway, so yeah, so it's quite a cool cube. And in my opinion, when it's all silvered up, stickered and silvered, stick it up in silver, it'll look quite dandy. But yeah, so that's my unboxing of the Dian Zanchi Blue Ghost Cube and Sheng Xiao Killerminx with some silver stickers as well. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like down below and comment because everything helps. And subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Oh yes, and Go order offline, order on Speedcube, link down in the description for you all because they're such awesome people. 
and they will get your cubes there in a nice fashion and uh yeah they won't do a dodgy on you and get sting you out of the deal so yeah here's my there's my video thank you enjoy goodbye keep cubing guys